The teaser for the Minecraft movie has finally been released after numerous delays. The initial reaction has been quite mixed, some viewers love it while many experts their dislike. A major point of criticism is how the movie shows the feelings of Minecraft. Many feel it, it doesn't look Minecrafty to the point of being realistic, drawing comparisons to most and the realistic thumbnails shown on YouTube. It's pretty clear that the Hollywood video game industry isn't as hot, since releasing a one bad movie then could end another bad, so that could be a problem. Personally, I was excited about the movie, but as more videos surface, I got more worried I initially love the direction it seems to take a fun silly movie, but I have some concerns. The biggest issue for me is how the visuals don't quite capture the essence of Minecraft. While I don't mind the maps themselves, I believe the overall landscape doesn't reflect the game. I know what you're gonna say. Hear me out. To answer some of my opinions about the Minecraft movie are so divided, let's take a trip back to February 2014. That's when Minecraft creator Marcus Persson announced that Mojang was in talk with Warner Bros. Initially, we revealed that the movie was scheduled for release in 2018. However, things quickly changed. The original team said to create the film The Pirate Family Project in July 2015, and the new team was brought and pushing and released it to May 24, 2019. Unfortunately, due to scheduling conflicts, the directors left the production in August 2018. While there were discussions at Warner about new directors, no official announcements were made until April 2009, when the release was rescheduled for March 4, 2022. But then came, can you guess? COVID-19, which pushed the release date even far back as of April 20, the new release date is set for April 4, 2025. However, it's worth not knowing that this feels a bit uncertain as there are concerns that Warner Bros. might be pressured to release anything like with Sega in the Sonic movie. It seems the creators of the movie didn't want to put the effort, therefore adding productions to the trees and the block size being random. As if they didn't want to put in the effort to create something using the tools and limitations that players have been mastered in Minecraft release. This lack of creativity is what frustrates me the most. The terrain in particular doesn't resemble a typical Minecraft world, although the cave and cliffs revamped the world recently. And in the teaser, they had the let your imagination run wild. The, mass, the main point of criticism doesn't frustrate me the most since I think it's how they will look if part of a well life environment. But I still think that they should have taken creative liberties and changed it for not being scary since Minecraft demographic is one to little children too. So no numbers isn't given to little kids. That's it, I'm willing to give the creators the benefit of the doubt. Perhaps Steve was already in the world before Jason Momoa and the others. That Steve built everything we see in the teaser before arrival. That's what the Minecraft lover would say, lying to himself seems. They don't want Minecraft to be in the terrible vehicle adaptation se se section. Overall, I'm not rushing the movie too harshly based on the teaser alone. It's possible they show scenes that don't do the justice. We have seen movies that receive poor trailer reviews but turn out to be great. I genuinely hope the Minecraft movie lives up to my childhood game. As I really don't want to see a bad adaptation of a game once more, specifically with this game. Or one of us just seen an easy cash grab and just made for the money. With no love for the game. So that's my take in the, on the Minecraft movie. What are your thoughts? I'd like to hear your opinions in the comment section below.